more young women are being diagnosed with pre-cancer changes in their cervix. An obstetrician gynecologist at the Confanochi Teaching Hospital, Dr. Elizabeth Crenchill, has advised young women to go for periodic screening and disabuse their minds that cervical cancer is the preserve of old women. Beatrice Piogabra has more in this report. Cervical cancer occurs in the cells of the cervix, the lower part of the uterus that connects to the vagina. A sexually transmitted infection known as the human papilloma virus or HPV plays a major role in causing most cervical cancers. According to the Ghana Cancer Board, cervical cancer is a second killer of women after breast cancer. An estimated 3,000 women are diagnosed with cervical cancer annually in the country, with half of them dying. Like most cancers, there are no early signs and symptoms, but women experiencing abnormal bleeding, offensive and colored discharges, and pelvic pain are to report to the hospital for immediate attention. Although preventable and curable if detected early, health authorities are worried women often report late to the hospital when nothing can be done to save their lives. The number of young women who are being diagnosed with pre-cancer changes in the cervix is also on the increase. We use our speculum to give us access to your cervix, so that is what we do. It is not painful at all. 20-year-old Obenewa, as we chose to call her in this report, was experiencing irregular menstrual cycle and discharges. During a routine health check, her gynecologist encouraged her to undergo the cervical cancer screening. She was traumatized after being diagnosed with pre-cancer changes. But after a series of counseling, Obenewa accepted the condition and started immediate treatment. She is advocating screening for young women who are sexually exposed. I didn't really, I was afraid at the first time, but Doc made me know that. January has been declared a cervical cancer month to create awareness about the preventable disease. In Ghana, the awareness is being championed by the Medical Women Association of Ghana. Ashanti Regional Chairperson Dr. Ijoma Ayite Koko says lack of awareness of cervical cancer is contributing to the late-stage reporting of the disease at the hospitals. The cost for the screening is also a disincentive for most women. The Medical Women Association, with the support from some NGOs, is embarking on cervical screening activities in five regions of the country.